What's up everyone, Prometheus here with another Clip Champ tutorial. Let's get right into it guys. We'll be going over how I made this trailer or intro if you will to give you some ideas of what you could do on your channel or video to add a little extra something to it. So first we're going to start with the background. Uh, way at the bottom, we have you see we have multiple layers as such, but we do it one step at a time. I always usually start with the background of the image. Uh, of course we used pretty much everything from Clipchamp. Uh, basically stock video, free to use, and then we scrolled all to the bottom here. Uh, Keep scrolling, keep scrolling, and boom, this is what we use for the background here. All right, so next we started with, out with uh, the, as you say, footage crate um, Amber's hit. That is also would be on the website, uh, Production Crate. Just links in the description will be down below, so click on that. It has a free version and a paid version. Uh, obviously, the ones with the stars are going to be the paid version, and the ones that are not starred uh, or free to use um, but I did use some paid versions of this but you could easily be used and manipulated with the free stuff I just wanted to kind of make it uh, as best as possible and in the next right here we have our text we use the simple uh, large uh, heading we as you can see it fades and we change this color this is the black color and then over here we kind of like positioned it to where uh, the exact moment is where it will change uh, and we'll move it to it'll be colored uh, red right there so uh, now the next layer up this took a lot of uh, drag and drop and then kind of get the timing right so we have our ambers right here which pop up uh, immediately and then we have our large heading here that pops up with the black and then I used a simple uh, text whatever it was uh, available in uh, Clipchamp now we have our footage crates right here as you can see and we kind of just went with it and positioned it as you can tell from right here we positioned it to where it kind of starts pretty close onto this uh, and then the other thing we did on these clips because we kind of position them in different spots that way it kind of covers the whole text we went to the uh, filters here and these we kind of wanted to make it the same color as the background so what we ended up doing was scrolling down to the bottom they have a lot of good stuff here uh we use gloomy give it that little ash looking kind of deal um i was super surprised uh, how well it kind of manipulated it of course each monitor and or you know a tv screen is going to show different shades of color it's not going to be on everywhere but uh yeah so that's how let's um basically we just took i took my time and uh play this over and over again to try to get the best uh, look to it. And then of course at the bottom here uh, we added um, the crackling for the embers and then I added this trailer uh, rise trailer riser that was also on pr uh, production crate but if you think about it there's a couple of ones here on sound effects tabs it, in case you're looking for something most of them are unfortunately um, paid versions but uh, it's something to look at and of course like I said the sound effects trailer was in production crate and um, if you could do some googling maybe some leg work you could find uh, free I think it's freesound.org has a couple of good stuff that people make and it's uh, free to use so those are definitely i'll have those all links in the description but it's fairly simple uh it just took a lot the timing was the most thing and if you take your time more time to do it it'd probably look a lot better than what i just said right now but yeah it's very simple i just wanted to show uh everyone like uh, clip champ that this there's more to it than just simple stuff you can add more and spice it up a little bit uh utilize other things as far as uh 
uh, production crate to make it a little more spicy. Uh, there you go, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, smash that like button. Please subscribe. It helps me out a lot. And uh, I'll see you guys next video. Happy editing, my friends.